So... Not that way. Okay, now we want to go where I was going before. I swear if there are enemies... Oh, there are totally enemies. Um... Open that door. Oh, open the door. Shepard, please. Okay. Throw you. Okay, that didn't work. Cool. Not a good angle here. Oh jeez. Ah! Someone save me. Uh um 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 I've lost shield. I can't okay. Get 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 <laughs> Thank you, Shepard. Uh This game is a bit clunky, but it's not awful. And I can live with it, but not playing it for a while and coming back to it is kind of weird. But like I said, I'll get used to it and I won't be quite as terrible. Oh, Garrus died. So that's good. What am I doing? I should be using my shotgun. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ah. Ah. Throw him. Didn't work. I think he's the only one left. Rush him. Ah! Ah! Ugh. Yeah! Come on, Garrus, get up. We got a quarry in to rescue. Heal up. And let's go. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. We'll level up later. Go, go, go! The music stopped and had to re-loop there. That's funny. I've never noticed that. Through the door. Open the door. Open the door. Get on the floor! How many times am I gonna sing that today? Hey. Did you bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Alright. Uh. Our grenade. Ha! Oh, it didn't hit anything. We gotta rescue this quarian. Although she looks like she's doing alright on her own. I can't hit him from here. Wow. Someone sabotaged my gun, and that makes me sad. Is Garrus down again? Yeah, he is. Garrus is really squishy. All right, we did it. Just set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Were you hurt in the fight? I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. Who are you? My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. The ambassador's office. It's safe here. We'll want to see this anyway. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? A quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? Making your day, Ambassador. She has information linking Saren to the Geth. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, Miss... My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars, only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. What kinds of things do you look for? It could be resources like food or fuel, or some type of useful technology, or even knowledge that will make life easier on the flotilla. Through our pilgrimage, we prove that we will contribute to the community, rather than being a burden on our limited resources. Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, 
The Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful, and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. He said Eden Prime brought him one step closer to finding the conduit. Any idea what that means? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. Are they some kind of new alien species? According to the Memory Corps, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. The Reapers are a threat to every species in Citadel space. We have to tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audio files prove Saren's a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her, the Quarian? My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. I thought you were on your pilgrimage. The pilgrimage proves we are willing to give of ourselves for the greater good. What does it say about me if I turn my back on this? Saren is a danger to the entire galaxy. My pilgrimage can wait. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the Council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. Alright, so already we have our fourth party member. And as you can see here, there are only two more to get. So we're we're doing good. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna take Garrus with me again. And I don't need more tech. Tali is straight tech. So I she won't really fit properly. So I'm just going to keep Ashley around for now. Keep the same squad we had before. Okay. So we got to get to the council. And... Yeah. I was going to try and think of something like the little song? Question mark. But I couldn't think of anything that rhymes with council. Sure. Commander Shepard. My name is Samesh Patia. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. It's no trouble. What can I do for you? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. Wait, the 212? Your wife was serviceman Narali Bhatia. I'm Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams. I served in her unit. Chief Williams, it is a pleasure. Nirali spoke of you with great respect. I'm so sorry for your loss, Mr. Bhatia. Narali was a good woman. What can we do for you? I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. There's no reason for your wife's body to be held like this. Just wait here. The man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. 
When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral and the respect she deserves. Well, that sounds reasonable enough. We better go to that expensive bar and tell that guy what's what. Oh, wait, before I do that, though, I'm gonna go ahead and level up. Because I haven't done that yet. Alright, so let's see here. Um. Where's my pistol thingamadoodle? My pistol thingamadoodle? Oh, I need overload. That's something I want. Get overload. Um. Put more into Sentinel. More into. Intimidate. Good. Ashley. And Garrus, good. Equipment. We got a bunch of new stuff. So, shotgun. Ooh, we got a lot of stuff. Whoa. Okay. Bullets. Hammerhead. I'm gonna go with weapons force for the shotgun. And pack a big ol' punch. Uh, that looks pretty good. Equip that. Transfer my stuff. Keep the heat sinks. I really like heat sinks. Um, weapons force. Yeah. Cool. And uh, we don't need that. Do I have any grenade mods? No. I don't think we'll be getting any grenade mods for a while. That Omni tool. I don't really like it because I lose my shield and med recharge bonuses for tech cooldown. I'd rather live a bit longer. Um, got any new armor ones? Armor plating, hardened weave. Let's go with armor plating. I'm not much of a tank, so anything I can get is helpful. Um, one accuracy rating, really? Jeez. Um, you're good with that one, I think. Um,. You know what, Mark? Just skip ahead to once I'm done all this, because it's going to take a while. <laughs> okay, dealt with that. I figured it was going to take a while, so I would just go ahead and do the rest on my own. Uh, this is not the room we want. It is the one over here. I believe it's... No, not that one. This one. Yeah. And we want to talk to... My goodness, you're Commander Shepard. Your activities made for quite a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? Yes. A man named Samesh Batya is having some trouble claiming his wife's body. Ah, Mr. Batya. A good man in an understandably frustrating position. I wish I could help him. Serviceman Nirali Batya died on Eden Prime, as Mr. Batya no doubt told you. Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. That is why her body is being held. You think her body might be dangerous or contaminated? No, Commander. Nurali Bhatia is not dangerous. Her body is, in fact, extremely valuable to the Alliance. The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, Serviceman Bhatia may save more lives in death than she did in life. Can you not, like, I don't know, find another body? I'm sure there are plenty. Pl Plenty of bodies killed by Geth. Mm, uh, I, I don't know. I understand what you're trying to do, but holding the body is wrong. Commander, you of all people should understand how far we must go to protect humanity. Is this what I'm out there fighting for? A government that steals the bodies of its honored dead? All right, Commander. You win. It was hard enough refusing Mr. Batia. I'm not going to risk an incident by refusing you. Tell Samesh that the body is being shipped back to Earth. I'll go now to see to it myself. Okay. We did it. That that's about it. Alright. Um getting close to my the end of this session. I don't think we'll be going to see the council today. But we'll talk to Samesh. Hello again, Commander. Has there been any word? 
I reminded Mr. Bosker what we're fighting for. Your wife is coming home. Thank you. I will return home and begin my preparations. It does not bring me happiness, but it may bring me peace. Goodbye, Commander. Samesh, I don't know if this helps, but your wife, Nirali, loved you very much. She missed your cooking, and she played recordings of you every night before she went to sleep. I know, Miss Williams. But thank you. It's nice to hear it again. Oh. All right. Um So I think we're just about done tonight. I'm going to go over a few things though. We have our journal here which shows all our missions and side missions, which is nice. I need to find Rex at some point. He's at Seasick, so I'll remember that. And but another thing is um there may be a lot of things you don't understand about like what's going on like how where are all, what are all these different types of uh, races and whatnot or just the story in general well this is the codex and this the Asari were the first species to discover the citadel the second species to join the citadel the Salarians roughly 1200 years ago the Turians were but yes anyways this will tell you basically anything you might be curious about. The Geth are a humanoid race of networked AIs. Yes. So yeah, um, if you're confused, a bit lost, this is what you want. Or, if you don't own the game and you're still curious, you can always check out the Mass Effect wiki, because that thing is massive. And yeah, it'll, it'll tell you what you want to know, but beware of spoilers. Um... But yeah, that's all I can really think about right now. Um, so I guess next time, we'll go to the council with that evidence, and hopefully, finally catch Saren in the act. Well, not catch Saren in the act, but show everyone what we know. So yeah, that's it for now. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.